Family Renew community has been around since 1989, so it's been it's been 30 years. And just to know that Family Renew has done good for for 30 years, you know, we're celebrating our 30 years this year, which is a, which is a big deal, helping homeless families with children. Family Renew since the beginning has probably helped over 1,200 families. We have been donating to uh, Family Renew since since the work started in 89, I believe. Currently we have 32 apartments. We've got three facilities that are all funded by our donors, our organization, our thrift store. So 100% of the money donated to Family Renew goes to help our families and our, and our various programs that we put together for them. In Volusia County, there are over 2,700 homeless children. When we encounter families, oftentimes they have lost hope. Families will go through a, a host of different problems. You know, there's no one issue that causes homelessness. I never thought of being homeless, you know, I would be in that situation. I came to Family New with my six kids, the oldest, I think she was in high school, the youngest, he was, had to be like seven months old. And so, it was very hard. We had called around to all the shelters. We tried family houses on the couches, but they wasn't, it wasn't, it's just a lot to have six people on your couch for a long number of time. So we ended up having to stay in our actual SUV. Her family fell on hard times and she had six kids as well, just like myself. And to see how she came in broken as well. Now we both had to still go to work, you know, try to do their hair in the, in the car. So I got to open the door, do their hair right there in the car. And that's how we had to get ready. All six kids in two adults. And it was really, really difficult. One of the greatest things I get to do is to have a child come in and they look and they go, we go, that's your bed. And they've never been in a bed before. So they're like, that's mine. And we also put toys on the bed that are for the child. And families get to keep the furniture and the housewares so that they're now getting reestablished again. They squished that room with two bunk beds so we could have four beds. And then we had a futon and a couch in the living room and we just made it work. And everybody slept and got everything in. Honestly, she took it to heart, and it's a lot of the families I see when you give them, okay, this is the goals that I want you to work to. She was one, her and her family, she took it to heart, and she worked hard, and you see the fruit of her labor, like everything that she was doing, it was, it was amazing. I see the growth in her, you know, from when she first came in. Even to this day, we still talk to Ms. Anita with advice. When she seen us, she seen the big picture, which is, you got eight in the seven. But then she took the time to work on every last one of us. Trisha, she's really made a lot of strides. Um, they paid off a lot of debt as myself as well. Um, just teaching them different strategies. We got to learn more things, like reading with them more and doing things because you don't have all those other things to distract you, like putting them on a video game or doing that. So we played more board games. Made it a lot easier and we bond a lot more than we did before. To see her to go back to school and how working on different counseling in her marriage and with the children with starting counseling and for her to go back to school and pursue her AA degree, she's still going to school for that, but then to actually go to the police academy and every month she stayed on us like, let me see your grades in class. <laughs> let me <laughs> Let me see your budget for this week. We're a very intrusive program into the families, so we look at their finances, we look at their behavior, we look at the way they spend money. Every family that comes into Family Renew must either be employed or employable. We've come just a lot now. I've With the tools that they did. Yep, I've graduated out of the police academy, um, top of the second top of the class, and um, GPA 4.0 rolled right into my associate's degree. He's been able to have a better contracting job where he doesn't have to leave and be gone for days. He can go to work at night and be more back in the set, morning. More of a set schedule. I know when I'm doing something. 
Average now these days, our families stay with us about six to seven months. The quicker we can move folks into their own lives, the more families we can help. This gives a chance for the whole family to get back together and reborn and blossom a little bit. Family renew. 96% <laughs> of them, when they leave us, are stably housed. They have regular jobs. 84% of them have, are making more money than when they left Family Renew. And, and two years later, they are still stably housed. That's the dream of Family Renew. Just a quarter of what we learned there, we could have probably avoided going into the shelter and kind of like manage better because some of those things that we learned had nothing to do with us being homeless. It's just life things, right. budgeting and communication, trust and supportive and all that with the children. We learned all those things and that helped us now. There's a lot of homeless children in Volusia County that kind of fly under the radar. We don't want them to fly under the radar. We want to give them a safe place to stay so that they can, their parents can not only rebuild their lives, but the kids can have a nice, healthy upbringing as well. They can figure out that there is hope and that they don't have to stay in a circumstance that's, that's unpleasant. I always tell families, you know, the, the road that's ahead of you is, is tough, but let me promise you something. We will hold your hand while you're going through it but we're not going to do it for you. So it's really a self-sufficiency program. It's really uh, helping people rise again to, to the needs in their life. All of our children are doing really great right now in school. Academics is high. We have a bunch of robotic engineers, computer science kids, um, honor rolls and cheerleaders. And soccer is coming back up in track and everybody's found something that they got to look in. We have two vehicles now. We're not transporting in one, one truck anymore, and we have knocked our debt down extremely. Family Renew, you've been an inspiration to so many people, and you've given so many people a new start. While I was here, I was able to save up my money, I was able to work, I was able to, you know, work towards self-sufficiency. So when I actually left Family Renew, I was able to move into um, a house, a four bedroom house. Because I was able to save up my money, I was able to buy furniture, stuff that I lost in storage at the time. It just granted me opportunities I didn't have if I was you know, somewhere else. I think with Family Renew, if you volunteer in a way where even if you're just coming by to mentor some of the kids, if you're coming by to help fix up the place, if there's some painting or yard work that needs done, or we've got some groups that do gardening, and you're really directly involved in helping someone get out of the circumstance that they're in. You're not just continuing to prolong how much they have to be in that circumstance. Everybody from the person who donates diapers that we're always in need of, to the person who writes the, the big check, or the person who's giving whatever they can, they're all part of the success we have. We could not do what we do without the people who support us. Just to have the opportunity to give back to the families, that is more than enough for me. I love it with everything in me. I love to see the families that come and when they leave and I still have that connection with them after they leave um, because it really means and I let them know I said whenever you do something you do something out of the goodness of your heart I think that's what's the biggest thing I think Family New has a big heart and when they do it they do it because you know they love and it's, it shows and it shows. Anytime uh, an organization is in business for 30 years um, you must be doing something right and, and it goes to show you that your donations do make a difference. It's awesome to give back and to see how we're, I'm able to actually pour back into the family's lives, you know, as a case manager now, and to let them know this is my story and to see how they're like, oh my gosh, and I'm like, if I can do it, you can do it. So it's awesome, it's awesome. So from my family to yours, thank you. Thank you for your donations. From the bottom of my heart, I pray for you. I thank you, I think of you often because we just could not do what we do without you.